Hello Sagittarius, this is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss with your November 2018 mini tarot reading. Let's take a shuffle here and see what's coming up for you. Here we go. Please remember this is a general reading and if you'd like one just about you, stop by my website. The information is below and it's www.soulstarbliss.com. Get yourself an appointment, we'll get to it as quickly as we can. But let's see what's going on for you in November. Here we go. Okay. Oop. Okay, it looks like there's going to be reasons to celebrate. I have two threes, and I'm hearing that something is completed that's going to have a reason to celebrate, but it also opens a door for the future. Not exactly sure what that means, but I hope that's for everybody, and I'm not even sure that it is for everybody, but it's a big deal. It says, in the past, um, maybe some foolish choices were made, some delays were, but something's changed. Something's changed within you. You got this get up and go, giddy up and buckle up, because what you put into whatever you're working on right now or have been working on for this year, last year, um, something like that, is really going to take off for you. It says you're worried about how you're going to finish something, how you're going to get it done. Trust. You got to have trust that you've got to believe in yourself. And I hope you're getting the support from your family that you need. And if you're not, and you still believe in what you're doing, continue forward because it's going to pay off for you. All those wants, wishes, and daydreams that you have, you're going to get help. If you're not getting help from those around you, somebody is going to help you with what you're working on. Don't give your power or your money away. If you're working on something with a contingency or a fee or a, uh, I don't know, um, a bonus, Stick to your guns because you, you have something coming and it's going to be, has to do with money and it's going to be very good for you and your family, those of you that have family. It says you're going to be surprised how many people want to work with you or help you. Just let it be known that you need help. Sometimes it's hard to ask for help. Ask for help because they're, someone's going to be there to help you. In the relationship department for some, it just seems like it's kind of been like, you know, it's time to stir stuff up, I guess, or, or make things happen. Maybe it's been humdrum. Maybe things just haven't been the way you wanted. Take another look. I think you're going to be surprised because maybe they're feeling the same way. Maybe you just need to sit down and talk. Maybe you need to pack a little picnic and go and sit on a park bench and talk or something out of the ordinary. Don't let anyone take your dreams from you. You've worked too hard and come too far to let that go. I feel prosperity is here for you and abundance. And abundance isn't always money. Prosperity usually is. But something's going on here. Your intuition is just really, really working good. And, of course, carryover from Halloween. The veils are, are, are uh, pretty <laughs> light, I guess you'd want to say. Take advantage of this time. Whatever you're needing, ask for it. There's already stuff in the works that maybe you've asked for. Get ready because it's coming. You may feel like things are being delayed. I don't think so. I'm a firm believer in... Everything we know um, shows up in divine time. And that's kind of what it's saying here for you. You know, maybe things kind of fell apart, got put back together, and they're, you know, uh, and I'm not sure if this is relationship or work. Maybe both for different people or, or uh, one for each person. But it says all of this havoc is the word I heard going on is going to bring you what you want. It says balance yourself. Balance is so important. I just see black and white. Everything is black and white, black and white look and open to receive it says that you're going to make some choices you're kind of afraid to make some of them don't be you're, if you're prayed and asked for guidance or asked for a sign or whatever it says trust what you see and trust what you know other people may be trying to put words in your mouth i hope that's not happening for you if you're feeling like you're alone even when you're with people you're not alone you got a lot of spirit help around you, a lot of energy, a lot of things that you're going to be able to do. Your apprenticeship seems to be over now. It seems like you, you know, you know what you have to do and just keep moving forward. I think it's going to be real good for a lot of you. All that hard work you've put in is going to bring you the sun card, which is joy, happiness, bliss, ease, whatever, however you want to put it. Sweet victory is right here before you. It says if counsel is needed, and remember, counsel can be an attorney, it could be a therapist, but it also could be two friends talking or two people talking. So if something isn't quite right, talk, speak up, state it, but do it in a kind way, and that'll certainly come back to you. Um, it says, I get the feeling someone's wanting, or people are wanting to take a journey and they can't right now. There's a reason for that, and you'll see the, the reason later. But it says the magician is here. What you ask for will be coming. So ask for it, buckle up, and get out of the way and let it arrive for you. Don't worry about the uh, what ifs, okay? Um, this here just to me, 
I'm hearing that, oh, what if this don't work? Or what if that don't work? Well, what if it does? <laughs> so try to, when you have those thoughts, and we all have them, myself included, we just have to kind of let those go and open to the spirit help or the joy, bliss, and ease. Or, or, or knowing that when we ask for something, and, and it comes in divine time and it will show up for you. I just have a feeling this month is going to be, there's going to be a lot of people around you. And I feel a lot of family forgiveness. I'm not sure what that means, but it, I hope it sounds fantastic to me. It says, get ready to make your choices for the new year. And this is kind of early for that, but hey, maybe you want, want to start your list. Remember, when we write it down, it's a list. When we put a date on it, it's a goal. And with that said, Sagittarius, happy Thanksgiving to those in the States or who celebrate. And blessings to everyone and their families. This is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss. Thank you so much for stopping by. And I'll see you again next month.